So welcome to this video and just want to say we often see people on campsites set up on campsites and they've got like wire fences around their, uh, their motorhomes and caravans to keep their dogs under control. So when I was contacted by Pick Kit Fence to have a look at their products, I thought it would be quite interesting. It's a new product and it was launched in 2022, this year in fact. Uh, we met them at the Norfolk show and uh, we showed that in the video, the first, was it the first video? Yeah, from, from the, the Norfolk, Norfolk show. show, yeah. And I'll put a link. Somewhere up there. There, here. So they offered us two fence panel kits. They come in uh, to a kit of four. I must admit that when I saw the size of the two kits, um, I wondered how we'd get them in the van. So I asked her friend Alison, who was with us, if she would be willing to try one of the kits herself. So in this video we're going to look at how it's put together, how you might use it and let you know what we think about it. It might help you decide if you should get a kit or two. Yeah. So what's in the kit? Well there's an eight panel kit and that costs £299 and that's got eight panels in it. Each panel is 860 millimeters by 1000 millimeters, uh, 1000 millimeters wide. It gives you an enclosed area of up to four square meters and uh, that could be square or rectangle or octagon. You get nine support feet, 12 safety clips, 18 rock pegs and two black carry bags and it all comes in two 10 kilogram bags. About 10 kilos that is. Let's find the zip. There's a bag that comes with it. So it's got pegs in it and the clips, which we'll come on to in a moment. Let's just empty those out. Okay. And this is one of the fence panels. See, it um, feels quite strong, but it is, you can feel it's flexible. You look at how it's made. And you've got two ends to it. You've got that bit there and this bit here. And on this end, got one of there where the pegs go and, and that. Comes in different colours, doesn't it? I seem to remember. So let's just put that to one side. There's the other three panels in there. comes with four posts. Let me just show you these. Oh, sorry, five posts, isn't it? One spare. So what you've got is you've got holes for the posts, it says post, and holes where the gate goes. And then these are the pegging out points on there. That feels quite tough. So what you do, put them down. Well, you want it. Move that away. And it's just a case then of putting that in there and putting that in there like that. So that's one side. And then that one goes in there. And then you realise you should have done it that way. That's it. And that's where you put a clip. That's your clip on there. And do the same over here. I want like that. You have to whoop, yep. lift that over. Put that that's the tricky bit I suppose there just getting that to go over like that 
And once you've done that, you can clip it. Put the clip in. Put that one in the post and that one in the gate. So if you want to open the gate, that's it. And you pull that off and the gate's open. So it's just a case of using the gate hole when you're using the gate itself. And that's your gate. And use these. To pick in. Normally use a hammer. So the ground's very soft. Right. That's it. All done. God blimey, that sun's bright. Come on, guys. In you go, in you go, go, Bobby, go on, good, 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 in you go. Oh, thanks, Bobs. <laughs> there we go. That's it, trapped one dog. I think, obviously, Although they could try and get out. It needs to be bigger. Mm. It really does. So what are the drawbacks? Well, I think the main thing I think we've already mentioned is the size and possibly the weight of it. We really did struggle to find a home it for it in the motorhome. It wouldn't fit under our beds. So we traveled with it in the shower room as we haven't got a garage. And I think if you've got a garage, this would be quite different for people. Yeah, and provided you know, your door was high enough to get it in. Yeah, so bear in mind it's 860 millimetres tall. And if you had a caravan and you had a, a large tow car, I mean, we put it in the back of the up, but it took up the whole of the, the yeah. back where the seats folded down, didn't it? Yeah, that's right. Um, you do, so you do need, I think you need two packs. We only yeah. had one pack to try, so I think if you've got two packs, it might be quite different. Yeah, and also just be aware that some sites will still require you to have your dog on um, on a lead or, you know, one of the posts, even yeah. if you have got a fence. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, so just watch out for the, uh, yeah. the site managers coming round <laughs> and telling you off. Yeah, no. yeah. So just be aware of that. So what are the advantages of the pick kit fence? Well, it feels strong, sturdy and well made. It's designed and made in the UK and it's easy to assemble. Even I can do it. <laughs> it's a great way to provide a secure and safe place for your pets, and not just dogs. So, cats, rabbits, maybe. I'm not sure about cats, but <laughs> <laughs> tortoises. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it's versatile, and you use it like a fenced area around the motorhome, uh, or the caravan doors, or perhaps around the awning. Yeah. And you perhaps use it as temporary borders, so, you know, if you want to put up a border between you and your neighbours on the campsite, I suppose you could do that as well. Yeah. Alison yes. used a blow-up windbreak, yeah. didn't she? Yeah. But because that hadn't got a gate, the advantage of this, because she's got the gate to open yeah. in and out. That's right. And also she's tried her kit at home and she's used it to keep the rabbits <laughs> off the vegetable patch. Yeah. The novel idea for it. Yeah, uh, and I think it's great if you're on campsite for a week or two, mm. maybe. Uh, it really does provide a nice little area for your pets. And they can roam around relatively free yeah. and not bother other people. So I think it's great for that. Uh, another advantage is free delivery as well. Yes. So included in the price is free delivery. Now, additionally, if you are a Caravan and Motown Club member, there's a member's offer for this. And I'll put the link down here somewhere and you can get £20 off an eight fence kit. So I think that's all for now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, um, let us know what you think. Is it something you'd be interested in? Um, let us know, and we'll say thanks for watching. Yeah. And I'll catch up with you in the next one. Okay then, bye then. Bye then. That's it. What do you think? Hey? I think you could take your lead off.
All right, we'll just be here. See how we get on with this. Yeah. So where's my chair? <laughs> yeah. <laughs>